All right, so we're at the Moxie Pali now. There's Jose over there. We're about to go in here and get a few things as well. It's been raining on our head the whole walk here. I'm drenched. Hey guys, so today I'm just actually going to be doing a quick little haul video for you, our grocery shopping. Now, we normally do go to Price Mart like you've seen, and we normally get our big pieces, things, um, but we were running low on some of our products that we like just to keep here at the house, so I decided just to go out tonight and get a few of those things. So I'm just actually going to go through them. We went to a store called Pequeno Mundo and this store actually has amazing deals. Um, but it is sometimes brands that you would not hear of, but honestly, they're just as good. So I'm going to start off here. I'm actually kind of excited about this find. You need to remember that I'm in Costa Rica. So sometimes when I'm trying to find things, um, that make me feel like home, I mean, it's kind of hard to do, but I found these, they are called pita chips and they are in sea salt they had garlic garlic ones too they were only two dollars i mean it is kind of a fairly small bag but honestly i'm like really excited to get this fine the second thing that i got is soda crackers now these are like a garlic herb type of cracker and i'm explaining everything because of the simple fact that some of it's not in english these are actually super good with um, just maybe some cream cheese or throw it in your bag when you're on the way to work just to have a cracker. And, um, I don't know if you guys know, but I've been having problems with like health issues. So I like to have something, you know, just to grab real quick if I need something to eat. The third thing looks like my husband picked this up. Um, he picked up, picked up some pops, pop ups, <laughs> I guess, pop tarts, strawberry. Also, um, at the Altamercado where we normally shop, these are these are just a pack of, you know, of course, normal popcorn. Normally, these are about, ooh, probably a dollar a piece. I got actually three of these for a dollar at the store, so I kind of stocked up on those. We don't actually eat popcorn too much unless we, we actually cook it ourselves a lot, so... Um, we got some of these cheese puffs. These cheese puffs were about a dollar, which was a pretty good deal. And we've actually already opened them and they taste good. So that's good. I got two onions um, from another store. We went to another store called Maxi Polly. And the onions, I think, were probably $0.25, 50 cent. Something in there. I got some Caesar dressing. I already had some blue cheese. And I do want something fat-free, but... Um, we did pick this up because it was only about 50 cent, or no, it's about 90 cent. Um, picked up a few bananas, a cucumber, and also I picked up these two little packs of Mentos to place in my purse. My husband picked up a little candy bar that we'll probably eat later. And this is actually Pesos, which is milk chocolate with raisins. And also I picked up about four pounds of potatoes. I'm actually thinking about making a crock pot recipe that has potatoes in it, so I wanted to have the potatoes either way, and if I decide not to make the recipe, hey, I'll make something else. We also picked up one of these little things. It normally goes with ice cream. These things are super good. If you ever come to Costa Rica, you have to try them. They're just like a, they're like the straw things that you see at Target or whatnot. Guys, I'm making a video here. Look, they're playing at my feet, and they're biting my toes. Um, also picked up a little apple juice. Um, this was around two dollars, really not bad, just to have a little bit of juice in the refrigerator. Picked up. I, this was my best find tonight. I feel like I wanted cream cheese to go with my potato soup if I decide to do it. Um, and this cream cheese is actually light, which made me super excited. And actually, cream cheese here is normally pretty expensive. Now I was able to find this for two dollars tonight. It's a it's a pretty big pack, so. I was really excited about this. Now, this is the whole reason I go to Pequeno Mundo, and this is where I get really excited about going to Pequeno Mundo, is because I can't find a lot of these things in um, locations near my house or whatnot. Well, if I, for example, chicken broth, if I go to get chicken broth, um, I would pay probably $3 a can for the chicken broth near my house were going on in my house the dogs were fighting and Jose was in the background I'm sorry I had to take a little second um, but these are normally around three to four dollars at the Alta Mercado one of the American um, grocery stores I have found a place the Pequeno Mundo where I go and I buy all my cans because they're only um, 90 cent to a dollar I got three cans of chicken broth um, I got two cans of just tomato soup 
All of these cans were a dollar or less. I got the New England clam chowder. Um, these were, I think, were about a dollar twenty. Actually, these were a little bit more. But honestly, at the Alta Mercado, me and Jose looked the other night. These um, these clam chowders were around five dollars. So I mean, awesome deal. Um, also got some diced tomatoes and rich thick juice and. I don't know, I feel like I can never have enough cream of chicken. Everything I seem to make wants cream of chicken, so I did grab four cans of that. And then I also just grabbed one can, I thought I grabbed two, but I only grabbed one of cream of mushroom soup. So at least I do have some of these things available for us when we need them for recipes. I also did buy um, this little bat jar of Worcestershire sour sauce. I mean, that's a pretty big jar. I got it for $1. I was pretty impressed with their prices. And just please remember that we live in Costa Rica, so things are much more costly when it comes to food. Food is one of the most expensive things here to me. So anyways, other than um, actual fruits and vegetables, I mean, things that I feel like I can get for cheaper in the States, I can't get here for as, at a good rate. And I guess maybe it's because I'm from the States and I like to have certain things because that's probably what the main reason is. Like, this kind of stuff makes my day because I can make my soups and my stuff like that. So, And then I have our little gallon of milk. Milk here is about $4 a gallon. So just to tell you guys, I was pretty impressed. I got all of that for around $40. I was pretty impressed that we were able to get it for that price. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed my vlog. I hope you enjoyed my vlog, and I hope you have a great night. Bye-bye.